Virginia Beach will appeal a federal ruling say the city's at-large voting system discriminates against people of color. The judge's decision came down in April, more than three years after a Virginia Beach woman filed the lawsuit. Eugene Daniel spoke to her and one councilman who questions the city's decision to appeal. I knew that we had a valid argument. I Latasha Holloway said she felt validated when a U.S. district judge sided with her in a lawsuit against the city of Virginia Beach in April. In a 133-page ruling, the court ruled the Beach's city council elections are not fair to people of color, saying it denies Hispanics, African Americans, and Asians equal access to the electoral and political process. It's a violation of the Voting Rights Act. But the city says it will appeal this month. Mayor Bobby Dyer said the decision comes after failed attempts to reach an agreeable settlement. Until now, registered voters could vote for all 11 council members, even if they do not represent their district. The lawsuit called for a more district-based approach, saying the current system weakens minority voting. And we have to do away with any system that will prohibit and restrict people of color from having a voice. The judge's decision cited a history of discrimination and a lack of elected minorities on council, among seven other factors. He called it illegal. The city disagrees, arguing in part the case does not show any one minority group is large enough to constitute a majority in any voting district. It also argues black, Hispanic, and Asian voters are not politically cohesive, and the law does not allow combining minority groups in this kind of lawsuit. I think it's important that the city take those issues very seriously and look at those issues and really get to the bottom of them. Councilman Aaron Rowell said the federal ruling was telling and the city should look into the findings. The judge ruled the voting system cannot continue in future elections. On top of that, a new Virginia law requires city council members only appear on ballots for voters living in their district which raises another question for Ralph. The ruling gave a July 1st deadline for proposals to change the voting system. Ultimately, a court will decide. Mayor Bobby Dyer said the city will actively participate. Reporting for 13 News Now, I'm Eugene Daniel. If you live in Virginia Beach and want to share your concerns, the city is holding two public hearings on the issue. The first is Tuesday, June 8th. The second is the following Tuesday, June 15th. Both held at the convention center and you can sign up online to speak.